Sinclair, consider the area you are in a special playground I have prepared just for you. Please try and keep me amused, and do not disappoint me by dying too soon. I so want to enjoy this. Hey, Redfield. <laughs> Gotta remember how to do this here. Controls in this game are kind of weird, but uh, this game is a fine fucking looking game, man. Claire looks fine as shit in this game. Nice tight ass as always. And, uh, yeah. Got the shotgun last time I was playing. Um, there might, I think there was another door I didn't go in, but I, I can't remember. So I'm hoping I'll find, I won't skip on anything. I'll try to get everything I can here, but I'm not playing this game to be too serious. I'm just playing it for fun. Um, you can switch between Moira and Claire. That's pretty snazzy. Uh, Moira uses a flashlight. Whoop. She's in a crowbar. She uses a flashlight to look for items. Um, she's not really a fighter, which is kind of annoying. Um, I haven't really played around with this much, but uh, I, I assume it really adds more to the like the, the whole exploration and like finding things. Um, but she can beat guys with a crowbar, which looks pretty fucking cool. <laughs> you know, a crowbar, that's always a sweet weapon. Finally, it's like better than, than a knife. But, uh... I definitely prefer playing as Claire. I want to have a gun with me, you know? I want to be in control of the fight. I don't want the AI wasting my bullets. Light bolts and shit. What? Who the fuck is quoting poetry? Are you afraid? You can tell me. Talk to me. What are you talking about? Is that you, GLaDOS? You are it. Ooh. And who exactly are you? Pretty sure she's talking to you. <laughs> kind of like Moira. So the firecracker. Let's see. Now if I like, does the computer know to take to shoot items to get them? I don't think it does. So I gotta be clear if I want to pick out, um, pick shit off the ceiling. You know. I mean, I just, I'm just hoping Moira doesn't turn out to be an Ashley from, from a. Resident Evil 4, where I have to babysit her the whole time. Oh yeah, you want some? You want some of this bitch? Come on out, fucker! Got two nice barrels to give to you. This looks like a way out. Ooh, a map! So we do get a map in this game. Can I see what the map looks like from here? Documents. No, it doesn't show us that. New records of the NAD, and oh my god, look at all this stuff. I think I got all this just for less than a buck. Less than a dollar for all this shit. When this game came out, it was probably like 50 bucks, and I'm playing it for like 80 cents. It's crazy, man. Oh, I know, Moira. I felt that way when I was getting blue screens. Moira! Give me the light, Moira. It's locked from the other side. Oh, did I just find a gear cog? Oh no, I need one to get through there, that's what it's telling me. Come on, shine the light around so I can see shit. This would really be cool for a two-player game, to have like your, your your helper like shine your light, you know? I don't know if this game's two-player or not, I haven't looked into it, but if it is, this, this would, might be actually pretty fun. I 
excerpt from Kafka's In the Penal Pe Penis Colony, the traveler asked. He doesn't know his own sentence, the officer replied. It would be useless to give him that information. He experiences it on his own body. Oh, fuck, I didn't read the whole thing. I don't know. I guess not. That's all there was to read. Uh, what did I do today? I vacuumed out my car. I uh, went grocery shopping. Um, I did some IT jobs. That's about it. That's a lot of my day. I made some chocolate chip muffins. Um, oh, yeah. Comfy. Yeah, let's, let's take, take one home. Look at this machine. There's something stuck in it. I could really go for some Indian food right now, some curry. I've been wanting to eat curry for a long time, but um, I like this Arroy curry I buy at the store. I always get chicken and broccoli, and I like, and then I. I, I cook it with chicken and broccoli, and then I and then I put some uh, jasmine rice, and it's really good. I love it. It's not working. The power must be off. Maybe there's a switch. Haven't been to any Indian restaurants in a long, long time, but uh, Indian food's pretty fucking good, man. Like non bread and uh, and um, the curry. Although they have this really, really, really fucking gross uh, dish that's like. Um, Tourniquet, manage that stops bleeding can be used even held by your partner. Oh, okay. Maybe I should give that to Moira. She can be the little healer. But yeah, Indian food's really good. They had this they had this gross like egg dish that was like it was like a cotton ball, like soaked in like sugar or something. It was just nasty. Like Yeah, I'll pass on your dessert. I'll eat I'll eat your goat meat and your like non bread, which is really delicious, but I'll, I'll pass on the desserts. Thank you very much. Parts. Customized gear kit? That do. I think that was in the first Revelations, customized gear at work, but ooh, you can upgrade and exchange your weapons at the workbench. A, upgrade, equip, remove, parts. exchange, swap out weapons you're carrying for the one you have. So it's like the item box. Damage level 1 upgrade. Yeah. This is, this is in the, the first Revelations, too. And uh, I don't know how I feel about it. it. It is a lot of micromanaging and, like, you know, playing around with shit. Like, in the first game, the first few games you didn't really have... Um, the first games you just found the weapon, that was it. You didn't upgrade it. Resident Evil 4 had upgrades, but that, that was, like, for money. That wasn't, like, picking out parts and adding new things. So, yeah, this is, like, one of those online multiplayer sort of things you can do. And uh, I'm not sure how I feel about it. But whatever, we'll see. It's it's Revelations, you know. It's not a, it's not a main entry. It's a Revelations title. Now what did I find for items? Did I find some key items somewhere? You can change the layout of weapon screen. We can use S or something. Yeah, I see that. We can just juggle back and forth between these. It's locked from the other side. Moira. <laughs> Moira. A workbench. But Barry, what about you? I have this. Uh, where do I need to go? Moira, I'll give you a boost. See if you can climb up. Okay. Getting some Ashley vibes here. Yeah. There's a strong girl. Welcome, Claire! <laughs> can I switch back? Oh, yeah, you can. Opening box and box will be locked. Move the cursor to unlock point. The position to unlock point can be determined by the color of the cursor. Cool, I got a, I got a breach of box. Huh. Some box will have, to, will have to be unlocked. Move the cursor to find the unlock point. The position of the lock point will determine the color of the cursor. Hint. A hint for unlock points will be given in the first box only. Okay, how, how does this fucking work? I gotta, okay, that's it. So that's... Oh, she got tired.
I don't get it. Ugh, more gameplay styles I have to figure out. Ah, oh, there we go. I just gotta find the boss. Sometimes there are multiple unlock points. Find them all to unlock the box. Oh boy. Nope. Ah, oh, shit. It was right there. Yeah, I don't know how I feel about this. This could get tedious. Here we go. Jimmy, it open, man. Moira, you are. First burglar, handgun case ammo. Happy Hanukkah, Marv! I have never actually opened anything with a crowbar in my life, but someday I'm gonna have to try because that looks—it looks, looks kind of fun. Jimmy and something open, you know. You get the, you get the long pull and you get to crank it open. Something about crowbars are uh, really devious, you know. They're like, they're like Molotov cocktails. There's just something about them, you know, that's entertaining. I don't encourage burglar and crime, but I don't know. Something about crowbars. You can beat people with them, you can use them to open things. When I was a very little kid, I went to a summer camp at one of my most hated times ever. This stupid place called Triangle Y Camp. And, um. Claire! Like, this, way. this guy was big into paddles. Like, he's like a paddle. A paddle is one of the most useful things you'll ever have, because. You know, with a paddle, you can oar with it, you can roll a boat with it, you can use it as a weapon, you could serve food on it. I'm just obsessed with paddles, like boat paddles. And it's like, eh. You can also, I can also give you an ass beating with the paddle, too. Would that count? Maybe once we're outside, we can find someone to help us. You know? So, I guess Moira's gonna be the same with her crowbar. I take a crowbar over a paddle any day. Moira! Come on, I want to kill some zombies, man. Bring, bring out some enemies. Lock from the other side. This is lame. I just want to get out of here. Me too. I just want to kill some guys. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. Moira, I'm getting mad. I better find an enemy or I'm going to kill you. Oh yeah, there we go. Boom. Is he dead? I'll give him another shot in the balls. Yeah, he's dead, alright. Yeah, nothing like a shotgun, man. Good old Doom style. I I've said it before, and I'll say it a million fucking times. No game, no video game I have ever played has done a shotgun better than Doom 1. Like, killing imps with a shotgun in Doom 1 is the most satisfying fucking thing in any gun game ever. The way they die, the way the noise, just the and they fall back, and it's just, it's lovely. I mean, it is, they nailed the sound effects so well in that, God, my God, that game is good. Prisoner's letter written in Russian. Dear Mama, I don't know if you ever get to read this, but I need you to call us experiments. They torture us every day. Every day. What did I do to deserve this? Why is this happening? It hurts so bad. Every day I'm scared of what will happen next. Mama, please, please help. Oh, Mother Russia! Baba! Baba! Yeah! Uh oh. It's been too long. Open. Yeah! This is what I like, man. Blowing guys up. Did Moira have her crow while she's still using her flashlight? Pull out your light, Moira. Make yourself useful. Is everybody dead? No, he's not. Rah! Ooh. Look at all to two shells in the shotgun. It's a, it's a piece of shit. I'll give it that. All right, I gotta see if I can find any any grub. Around ten. Where's the ten? Look around for the ten. 
I'm still afraid to watch Indiana Jones on the Last Crusade. Like, with the part with those rats. You know? Like, that in the fucking sewer, that scared the shit out of me. But, I have to say, Harrison Ford's acting, he, he had kind of a funny acting, the way he did with his, like, X marks the spot. And he finds it, and he just starts, like, body slamming the fucking wall, and, like, trips into, like, this puddle. And, I don't know, something about that movie it was... It was it was an eerie fucking movie, but it was good. It was corny, but it was good. What did you find? Did you... Did you... Ah, oh, handgun ammo. Ah, oh, 100 topaz. Resident Evil. I like the treasure better than the old ones. The man expressed his wish to pass through the gates. If you truly wish to pass through the gates and break the rules before the Ah, and his brother's keeper. And the finder of law. Ooh, an exploding bottle. How does that work? Throw a sub-weapon, exploding bottle. Can I equip that? Or does Moira not have the ability to equip those things? Let me see. Well, she can equip it. All right. All right. I can throw bottles at people. I can't use guns, but I can throw bottles. I'll take it. Moira. Uh, I like to upload these videos more, but it, it does take a lot of time on YouTube to upload them, so don't count on me uploading them too many too many times. Um, I won't upload these too much, but I'll try to get as much as I can. I'm gonna play a little bit more, and then I'm gonna stop it when I get to the next checkpoint because it's a lot of it's a lot of uh, a lot of shit. All right, all right. Let's see how far will it go here? Okay, throw it, throw it, you bitch! There you go. Ah, oh, yeah. Well, this is a pathetic explosion. No, I don't want to be here, you idiot. Reload. Reload! Reload! Deal with it, Moira. You know, use that crowbar. Ugh. Oh, can I kick him? Ugh. Stay down, bitch. That, that cocktail explosion was pretty pathetic, Capcom. Come on. Come on. Do it better. Moira, what do you got for me? Give me some, give me some bullets. Give me some sugar, babe. Did I did I get a checkpoint or not? How do I know if I passed a checkpoint? I'm assuming that's a checkpoint. I'm gonna go back out. Yeah, it's a checkpoint. I'm gonna reload here and just make sure it is because I got other things I gotta do. So I go through the door. All right, let's reload and see if it if it counted it. Fucking better. How do I know where my Oh shit, it didn't reload. Damn it. Oh, that's alright. Well, that's all for now. Um, these videos take a long time to upload, so I'm just going to put this for now, and yeah, I'll play again another time. Later.